Hello everyone, and welcome to another video. Today I will be looking at the top 5 picks in this year's NFL Draft. The Jacksonville Jaguars have the first pick, and I have them selecting Trevor Lawrence, a quarterback out of Clemson. He is probably the most NFL-ready player since Andrew Luck, or even John Elway. He is a very complete quarterback and is also very mobile. Please, Jaguars, don't mess this up. The New York Jets have the second overall pick, and I think they are going to take Zach Wilson, a quarterback out of BYU. After trading away Sam Darnold, the Jets need a quarterback, and they have been t looking at Wilson for months. He has amazing arm strength and toughness, but the reason I'm hesitant here is that he doesn't have as much experience being a junior as some of the other QBs in the class. After a blockbuster trade with the Dolphins, the San Francisco 49ers have the third overall pick, and I have them taking another quarterback, Justin Fields, from Ohio State. He can make basically any throw, no matter the situation, and he can fire passes into tight windows. However, he has had some issues with the blitz, and goes for the deep ball way too often. With that said, he is extremely talented, and I find that scouts are way too hard on him. The Atlanta Falcons have the 4th overall pick, and I have them drafting Kyle Pitts, a tight end from Florida. While it might seem like a reach to go for a tight end 4th overall, Kyle Pitts is the best tight end prospect we've seen in over a decade. He is over 6.5 feet tall and yet still has wide receiver type speed, making him an elite mismatch. But don't count out the possibility of the Atlanta Falcons trading down in order to address another position of need. The Cincinnati Bengals have the fifth overall pick, and I have them picking Penny Sewell, an offensive tackle out of Oregon. Even though they signed Riley Reef, the Bengals have a glaring need at the position. Protecting Joe Burrow should be their number one priority after he tore his ACL midseason. Sewell has the quickness to keep up with the fast edge rushers and has the ideal stature at 6'6", 320 pounds, and many view him as an ideal pass blocker. And that's going to be the end of the video. Thank you so much for watching. And if you would like me to do more than just the five picks, let me know in the comments. See you next time.